The objective of the Transec project is to improve the food situation for the most vulnerable rural population in Tanzania. During four years, more than 90 researchers will help local stakeholders to design and to identify successful food security upgrading strategies. Once the best strategies are identified, they will be implemented at different levels of policy, extension and research. Transec uh, has a very long history. Um, this is actually the 12th project we coordinated uh, at SALF in Sub-Saharan Africa. SALF developed now a certain expertise with regard to interdisciplinary research in Sub-Saharan Africa. We are currently 15 institutes involved. We are more than 100 researchers. Since 2005, we mostly were involved in topics of bioenergy and climate change adaptation. And the new topic, the Transec topic, food security, unifies all these different topics. And uh, this with regard to the major challenge. The major challenge is that we have to double the agriculture production in 2050. Food security is an urgent question. As the world population increases, the demand for agricultural products, such as food, fiber and fuel, grow. The per capita arable land decreases in a dramatic way, especially in Africa. On top of that, climate change, urbanization and environmental degradation will pose short and long-term challenges. The current food security in uh, Tanzania is uh, a 50-50 uh, situation. You have areas or regions in Tanzania where there is uh, a lot of food, but there are also areas where there, are, there is deficit. Tanzanian perspective, it means different things. When you talk to farmers whom we want to improve their food security, it's a, it's a different concept. What they need is to have their stomach filled. <laughs> they don't care much in terms of the quality of the food what they eat. The areas with high rainfall, there are areas where the rainfall is not very certain, and there are areas which are semi-arid. So the areas which are semi-arid, most of them frequently, they become food insecure. In September 2013, more than 100 partners from Tanzania, Germany and USA gathered in Morogoro to launch the Transit Kickoff Conference. Welcome to Tanzania. Welcome to Morogoro. Welcome to Sua. During our kick-off meeting here, we sit together, we discuss the work package structure and the task structure. And uh, the major challenge is to bring all involved people together, to let them communicate. The innovations developed within the Transec project will be tested in four villages in order to cover the regional differences. Transec is focused on local and regional food security, but the research design also implies a national outreach for Tanzania as a whole. Transec is going to work in two regions of Tanzania, one semi-arid and one sub-humid region. This is uh, the semi-arid Dodoma region in central part of Tanzania and the sub-humid part more 
to the east of Tanzania. And within both regions, we have two case study sites. These are village clusters of 800 to 2,000 households. It is a participatory demand-driven approach. This means we are testing and developing upgrading strategies together with the local stakeholders. They are telling us their demand and we are responding and we are working on field and off field along the food value chain. Um, if it comes to on field research, we are um, focusing on natural resource management, on food production. Um, if it comes to off-field activities, we are doing research in processing, in markets and in consumption and, uh, and in waste management. And these are the basic components of our food value chain in the villages. The innovative approach of Transec will place together researchers, politicians and farmers to identify and select the most promising strategies to ensure local food security. I think uh, this is a, a unique project which tries to upgrade the, the food system by working or promoting innovations at different scales from the local scale where the project will interact with the farmers and at sub-national scale, district level, where we'll also look at innovations that contribute to the upgrading of different components of the food value chain and also working with the policies at national level to see whether there could be something to improve or to, uh, to do some policy reforms that will actually help upgrade the food value chains and improve the food system. The international projects are very important um, and this is especially important because the funding mechanism in terms of uh, research funding uh, from the, our own uh, sources is not really sufficient to do some good research and to find solution to uh, problems especially related to agriculture because as you know agriculture by itself it cannot generate sufficient money which can also be the plowed back for research and, uh, and development. I think this, uh, the projects are very important because they complement the efforts of our government to ensure that if, uh, the farmers produce sufficient food for their own families but also for the entire country as a whole. My major objective is that we have a clear impact on the ground on the one hand side, uh, we work in two large regions in Tanzania. In four villages, we would like to reach 4,000 households to stabilize the food sit uh, situation. And uh, on the other hand, that we have also an impact at policy level. This means that we influence policy at Tanzanian level with regard to our results, that we can elaborate policy programs and therefore we need a close collaboration to the Ministry of Agriculture, Food Security and Cooperatives at, uh, in Dar Salaam. In order to ensure the whole potential of Transec, innovative supervision and mediation among the partners will be done by a section of the project. The CPM Conflict Prevention and Management Unit will be established to allow a good communication and if necessary conflict resolution. There are persons that have never worked together before and now they are doing it. So, um, like the fundament is a, a, a common or a, a collective culture which we have to um, develop during the kickoff uh, conference and the annual conference. And also the imbued component of our, our conflict management system. <coughs> if we use it properly, we are going to have a very good collaboration because when people are many uh, differences will definitely emerge. How are we going to solve those differences internally it will be very important.
what we see right now is uh, that it works wonderful and that we have a very good interaction between the different work units. The vision is that we have an impact not only for the regions but also for other regions uh, in Tanzania and uh, I hope that we will succeed. With all these activities, people in Tanzania will be significantly more food secure and farmers well prepared to cope with future challenges. Yeah.